We have already seen all the Picaro knowledge necessary to be able to study the most important objects. We will start studying the simplest M object, the PM objects. Let's see some examples of how this object is used before studying its source code. In order to use PM object, we have to add at least one point, and we can manipulate it like any other object. We can also make the points thicker using the stroke width parameter. We can add more than one point. These vectors always take as reference the center of the camera. We can also use the methods get center and get center of mass. The get center method puts all the points inside a rectangle, and the center of that rectangle is the return value, while get center of mass returns the average of all the control points. We can also transform PM objects with each other, but we cannot transform a PM object with a VM object since they are two different types of objects. All these points are stored in the points attribute. Let's analyze how Manum renders these objects. Go to the file you see on the screen and look for the method display point cloud, since this is the method that is in charge of rendering the PM objects on the screen. What this function does is basically draw several pixels around a coordinate, hence the name point cloud. However, all this is being done manually, but we can deduce all this work if we use Cairo. The first thing is to get the context, for that we use the method get Cairo context. Then, using the parameters of the function we can get the points, the thickness, and the color. Instead of drawing a square we will draw a circle, and the radius we will calculate it as the thickness multiplied by the conversion factor Cairo line width multiple that we studied in the intermediate course, whose default value is 0.01. Using all these parameters, we can draw the circle using the arc method that we saw in the Picaro tutorial. An interesting thing we can do is to draw lines instead of points. This code here draws a circle in case there is only one point and draws a series of lines in case there is more than one point. We see that everything works correctly, we can even see that the transformations work. In the next video, we are going to analyze, now, the VM objects.
As a special offer, I remind you that you can buy my two professional Manum courses for only $50, that is, the basic and intermediate course. The basic course costs $30 and the intermediate course costs $40, but if you buy the bundle, you can get both courses together for only $50. In case you have already purchased the basic course and want to buy the intermediate course, you can use the coupon you see on the screen to get $10 off only the intermediate course. These offers will be valid until June of this year.